season. Happy spooky season indeed. I'm Alfred. I'm Sarah. Welcome back to Dishonored. Uh, welcome back to very definitely the last mission in Dishonored because we're finally going after that motherfucking Lord Regent. Hell yeah. Hey. Um, so yeah, we're coming to the end of the Dishonored. We're going to do um, the DLC and Dishonored 2 at some point, but I don't know when. Uh, we've also got other plans for... Can we make the screen bigger? Uh, this is where the settings are. Oh, okay. Sorry. If you'd like, I can turn it towards you. Ooh, that works. Okay, cool. Nani? Whoever you are, I must thank you for sparing part of my family. We have enemies, certainly, we boil women. In a way, you've done me a favor, so you deserve a reward. <laughs> I've passed this along from one of my servants through another who knows another to one of yours. May we never cross paths again. Wait, wait, is that one of the sisters? Yeah. <laughs> hey, thanks for taking care of that bitch. <laughs> Yow. The fact that you can get a random one at any time is, and that note still happens is really funny, which means they all feel that way about each other. Wait, yeah, that's... <laughs> okay. Hey, thanks for selling my sister to a weird, creepy guy. Yeah. All right, so do you remember where all we were? Um, we just got done being terrible people. Well, yeah. And as you said, we're coming upon the last mission. Bendy. And now we've done away with a woman and a noble woman at that. But Boyle was a viper. She helped the Lord Regent kill the Empress. So I don't feel a thing for her. There's no room for emotions in this gigantic forehead. Oh yeah, we also shot that guy for this dude. This little item has been helpful to my family over the generations. But I think you'll find more use for it than I ever will. Go on. You've had a long night, Corvo, but I fear it's not over. Havelock and Martin have already cooked up something more for you. They would like to see you now, in Havelock's chambers above the bar. Ooh. Oh, it's not rat. There we go. Um. I thought you would have the skill tree more like filled out by this point in the game, honestly. Well, the thing is, and I'm only missing a... four. Oh, I guess you're right. Uh, and these are maxed out. This isn't maxed out. This isn't maxed out. This is maxed out. Does this, this count as a skill out. tree? Uh, not really. It's not. It's not really a tree. What would you call it then? Um, upgrades, I guess. Skill slots. Yeah, because like a skill tree has to be something like a tatau, where uh, uh, it's it's very sequential. I've already read that. What was it? It's the drunken whaler. Uh, again, again. Havelock, talk to me, baby. Everything we have done. Everything that you yeah, everything I've done. I'm the only one who does any fucking work around here. The By the way, his balls are out on stream. It is simple, but it will be far from easy. Far from easy. The Lord Regent's paranoia has reached an all-time So if we want, we can kill the, the, of the Lord Regent. The Parliament, his financial base. Who's the Lord Regent again? The guy who took over after uh, he killed so your, um, tower, he your, your your empress? Yeah. Um? He knows it's like episode 15. <laughs> You're still forgetting who the main villain is. <laughs> Listen, right around now is when my Ritalin wears off, so... Well, good thing we just started recording. <laughs> It's okay, I have Last some tea in me. You, there was the you get nice, authentic Sarah. Yeah. Now you will go there and end it. Adjusting the mic a little bit. I'm not sure what else we could say, other than our hopes are riding on you. Yada yada. Okay, so what are our options? We can kill the Lord Regent. We can not kill him, but yes, but it'll be overall worse for him if we do. If you kill him, or if you don't. If we let him live. Okay, so. Hmm. Ready to face the Lord Regent? About time we took care of my sake. Long past time. Look at him. Let's get the fuck out of here. I don't know. It would be kind of weird for us to be killing all of these guys and then just decide, 
you know what? I'll spare you. No, yeah, I hate that. It's time to end the Lord Regent's rule. And if you succeed, Emily can be crowned Empress. Turn to Delmall Tower and infiltrate the place where you once lived, the Lord Protector. And for Heroid, Lord Regent has upgraded security over the months and has a highly defended safe room to which he will escape if you set off any alarms. So, that mixes Ooh, it up. is this our last boat ride? This is it, Corvo. Yep. Oh. Last memories of Dunwall I cherish these moments with him. Good old Sammy. That's what his name is. I cherish these moments with you, Sammy. Samsworth. Uh, Samilton. The most important thing is killing the Lord Regent. Built himself quite a place at the top of the tower. Calls it his safe I think you can even see it from here. Crazy if you ask me. See what? The safe room, see? Point of interest oh, nice. I think it's that gigantic outcropping. The broadcast control station here where all them announcements come from. So we have access to the radio system that puts out information all over the city. Next time I see you, the Lord Regent will be dead. And if not, well, it was an honor to serve with you. Let's go. Can you not, like, can you, can you get in there without getting wet? Or does he kind of just, like, yeah, you're going to have to get wet. I could have gone to the right. And in fact, I might have to, considering that the water lock is off currently. I kind of want a game where um, you jump in the water and there is some type of consequence for when you get out. Like, you're extra squeaky. <laughs> so you get noticed more. Uh, in Metal Gear Solid 2, actually, uh, you can catch a cold. You get, like, a really bad chafing rash. Ugh. That was pretty clean. <laughs> Fuck. This is gonna be a real problem, huh? Ooh, ooh, that way. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Ooh, sneaky, sneaky. Is this just a dead guy over here? Yeah, there's but he a, had a bone charm. There's a dead guy and we didn't kill him? He's been eaten. I don't even know what that was. Healthy appetite, I guess? I have no idea. Wait, I know. Come on. In the good ending, do all the rats become domestic? <laughs> what the hell are these guys talking about? There's a, a little rat plinking around down there, and I wanted to I wanted to get at him. Because then I would, you know, be over there. Right above there. Yeah. Looks like. Oh. There we are. I'm sorry. Okay, well. What if you run super fast? Well, I'll save first. <laughs> Because, uh, you know. Also, why run when you could warp? Ooh, 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 spicy! Okay. Why, why did you turn into a monkey and then say spicy? Because cause you, uh, you got burnt. <laughs> <laughs> Become monkey. Monkey. There we go. Okay. Fuck. Fuck. No one is here. No one is... Also, yeah, you brought it up, but I, I do hate the, uh... The trope of, like, slaughtering a billion dudes who are just doing their job and happen to work for a bad guy. And then you come across the bad guy, and you're like, no, I'm going to be the bigger person. Killing me. And it's like, it, it's like, you know, obviously, if you let this guy live, you know, even if he has less power, he's still going to affect, you know, other people. Whereas his goons, you know, they may have just been trying to feed his fa feed their family. Yeah, killing, killing me, killing you will make me just as bad as you. No. Fucking ass. I hate that. It's like, no, you're like a mass murderer I've fascist. murdered and raped hundreds of people 
but if Kaylee... you kill me, one person who, again, is not morally competent, you will be just as bad. You hear that, Batman? You'll be just as bad. Ugh, Batman's so full of shit. The Joker tries to pull that shit on him all the time. Well, the Joker knows that Batman will eat out of his fucking hand, because Batman's an idiot. I think my favorite Joker moment is when he, um, Oh, shit. He, oh, fuck. He sees a Nazi, and he's like, you know, I might be a crazy person. But I'm an American <laughs> murderer. I may be a psychopathic murderer, but I'm an American psychopathic murderer. You know that's not a Nazi, that's the Red Skull. Oh. Yeah, that was in a crossover with uh, Captain America. Isn't he kind of a Nazi, though? The Red Skull? Yeah. Oh, yeah, he's a Nazi. He's just the boss of Nazis. Like, I, I just want to say, don't downplay the fact that that is the Red Skull. His face is so wrinkly sometimes. Okay. Maybe it's the lack of oxygen. Now I peek. Aging him rapidly. Yeah, that'll happen. Especially when I strangle people. Uh, let's blink over there. Blink. Do a little peeky pee. That one creepy guy taught you how to do that one. Ugh. God, could you imagine, like... Actually, I can. I was gonna say, imagine if, like, weird sex perverts, like, were how you upgraded your skills. And then I remember that in Yandere Sim, you, uh, take illicit photographs of people and sell them to a weird per pervert. Pretty sure that's just the Yandere dev. He modeled the creep after himself. Yeah, that's fair. We got a tall boy. God, those things are so fucking cool. I'm really upset that they only come in at this stage in the game, but I guess it's like, you know, if they had them here the whole time, it would just kind of be... I don't know. Like, you have to work for it, is you, what I'm trying to say. I mean, you explicitly do. They only show up when the plague gets real bad. Oh my god. So, what part of your body would walking on stilts work out? Um, your calves. I'm gonna get some skills. Fuck. My calves will be as good as yours are. Shit. This isn't going to plan. Oh my god! Oh! Look. What just happened? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Take two. Save your game up. Don't worry, game. I do. Uh, let's get smart about this. I got this ability. Nice. Oh, that's something I'm going to see in my nightmares. What is? A yellow tall boy below me. Yeah, that's pretty extreme. But hey, this means that it's safe. There, there's something that just really weirds me out about long-legged things, and it's, you know, it's kind of how you were telling me the other day about how we're kind of just hardwired to be afraid of things that move and look like spiders. But I'm not afraid of spiders, I'm afraid of long-legged things yeah. that aren't spiders. Did that... fuck, did that... nope, okay. Load the game. Am I distracting you? No, it's fine. Huh. So yeah, this is a real choke point, because I'm not really having a good time getting through here. Sleep. Sorry to be so quiet, I'm just like... You know. Focusing in hardcore, yeah. Pew, pew, pew. Perfect. Okay. Yeah, this night vision comes in. It's really good. Yeah, you can see why it's so useful. I'm gonna make a save here. I don't know if this is gonna be the like save that I'm using. Yeah, dark vision is super cool. Why don't you keep it? Can you only have so much of it? Uh, yeah, I don't want to waste it. Actually, I can't remember, but it does something. I'm gonna hide him in here because the other ones are down there, but no one will look in here. 
You just taking a little nappy new down there. Don't worry about it. Ugh, shouldn't have drank all that butter. Look at this fucking cunt. He built that fucking statue of himself. What an asshole. See, I wouldn't build a statue of myself, but I would have, like, a ornate painting of myself in my living room. Yeah. So, like, I'm not... It, it's for me, you know? It's not for everyone else. Yeah. Okay. Just got... It's so cool coming here. After it's all gone to shit? Yeah. How? Oh, come on. I'm invisible -est. Wait. Wait, can you take over his mind? Let's see. I can. Oh, yes. Nice. Can I play the game like this? <laughs> this is what it's like if you, uh, well, if you play as me. Okay, I'm gonna load a save. In real life. Yeah. I'm a tall boy. Six foot five, by the way. I don't know if you ever told them that, but. Uh, I might have brought it up. Uh, let's do that again. That was fantastic. Or maybe... Let's get this on. There he is. Oh, it has a range. Good That's old irritating. Chicken hmm. Yeah, this is... This could be a problem. Look at how cool the mechanism is, though. We can see it really safely here, but, like, it attaches to his ankles and calves. Yeah, I love that. All right, if you can get him here. Well, I'm not even sure if that's the right thing to do. Well, actually... Yes. I just noticed, as I was zooming into his face, he looks almost identical to uh, the Combine uh, Nova Prospect Guard. Okay, okay. Vote. You. You're the assassin. <laughs> Wait, is that a friend? I don't like these people. Either. I beg you just let me live so I can see my children again. Yeah. Aw. Good All guy. Right. Don't worry, bro. This is a good place to save, yeah. Uh yeah, this is a nice little nice little safety save. I saw him, I was like, fuck, we're gonna have to kill him, and then he's like Wait a second. Like, see, this is what I'm talking about. This is one of the goons who's, like, just here because he's trying to, you know. Well, he also looks like uh, one of the Bottle Street gang. So maybe he's in with, uh, 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 what's that guy's face? Big Nose or, what's that guy's name, Sarah? Oh, you're asking me? Yeah. Oh, no. He's the gangster. Uh, Slackjaw? Slackjaw. See? Yeah. I thought he was really cool, so that aided in me remembering his name. Yeah. And this will be shortcut. I don't remember the main villain, but I remember, uh, you know, I, I mean, I guess he's a pretty prominent character. So. I mean, no one that we know will ever be surprised by you failing to remember the name of the main antagonist of the game, but successfully remembering this rando gangster that you liked. Oh, fucking piranhas. Even here? Guys, come on. I'm getting nipped to death. Yeah, we might. Yep. Well, here we go. This save. I mean, in a way, it's kind of helpful, because, like, then you get to see the area. Oh, yeah. It's totally cheats. But I don't, I don't know how I feel about that, you know? Saves coming has always been a thing. Oh, wait. He asks... He says he can help me. Just use that valve to open the most overflow gate. You can get access to the tower's main door. Oh, he even warns me about the hack. Well, oh, shit. I like this guy. Whoa, really big yaoi hands, though. Yeah. What are you gonna do? Okay, then that means that this is a way to go, so I'll crack this. And then... I'll drop another save here. Cool. And then let's see if I can't get a, uh, a warp off. If you put the electric thing in the water, do you think it would kill all the piranhas? <laughs> that would be interesting. I don't know if they have that coded in. 
Ha! Nice. We've snuck it in. Okay. Dunwall Tower. What a mansion. Oh, there's a map above you. There are no reports of any disturbance. Oh. That's handy. That is. There are no reports of disturbances. Triple the guards. I kind of regret my decision to play this with a controller. It was mostly so we could position the uh, yes, Lord. the mic a little easier. Why do you say? Uh, because it means that I can't quick save. Mm, yeah. I'm heading up. It's got a fucking TV. I don't know, there's something nice about just holding a control in your hand, and that's that's probably why I never got into having my own PC and playing games on it. Yeah, oh. Okay, I'm cool. He's got a bust of himself over here. Alright, get in his head. Oh, okay, that was really sneaky, Connor. Well, remember that I've taken off my tap shoes. Right. You might want to take him somewhere. Yeah. Like this little broom cub bird. Okay, well. Let's do a little peeky pee. Yeah, that'll be pretty safe in there. Do you have anything? No. Look, he's got twin statues of himself. This guy's a motherfucker. Wait, he had this built in such a little amount of time, too. So no wonder that the city's gone to shit. The Lord Region is spending all the city's money on fucking statues of himself and shit. Fucking bourgeoisie. What an asshole. Also, you know, he did uh, have a, a good queen assassinated. Oh? Oh. What, what just happened? Oh. Okay, I don't want to do that. That's cool, but I would rather be what, just... What is that? Uh, it's, the, it's fucking Skype. No, no, no. What, are you supposed to do that? Is it part of the game? Is it an option? It's an option. It allows you to take your mask off and say, hey, fuck you, it's me, Corvo. Hey, wait a second, that's kind of cool, though. Oh, it's radical, but... Not what we're going for? No, because remember that our Corvo is just fucking creepy. Dig like, uh, uh, signing his name so they find out, like, hours after that the reason that the, the Boyle lady is gone is that Corvo was there. Okay. So because Good I use. yeah because I, I turned into him I was able to pass through this freely. And because he's just sitting on this couch it looks like he's just a regular guy. Nobody's here. Just a regular old fella. Splattered with blood. Yeah, I don't know if that's worked. Ah, uh, whatever. Let's run with it. Literally. Why not torturous chambers? Ew. Oh, it's all rats down here, huh? Well, why don't we use one of these? I've been saving this. Oh, he's immune to fire. Well, that sucks. Grenade? Yep. <laughs> you hit him in the head and it got it. Whoa. Awesome. Yep. Here you are, Corvo, within the high walls of your enemy's stronghold. What an impressive sight you make on your way to face the Lord Regent. How will you end his reign? By blood or by truth? He's not an easy man to get close to. 
if the Empress had been as well guarded, how different things would be now. Is it just revenge you're after, or do you have another plan? Now? So he says something very important there. Things, make it all by right blood or by truth. Empress, or will you send them all howling into the void? Is Either he have bruises on his face? No, he's just weird. Okay. I like how he says, I expect a good show. Because he knows. Nice. See how Corvo had a two-handed wrench it out of there? Deary, deary, deary. Down to the cellar, oh so dreary. Why don't you come out and see No, no, me? no, I want to read this one. Okay. Oh, deary, deary, down in the cellar, so dreary. Why won't you come out to see me? When you were here, we made them scream, didn't we? Come back to visit, and I'll give you another present, carved and shiny. You aren't much in the way of proper conversation, mind you, but I do love to watch you work. Come back, and I'll tell you stories, such stories, your dear granny. This guy's got it pretty hard. Did you like that? I did, yeah. Oh, good. Oh, I don't like that one bit. Pull this out. Good boys. You say that like you're talking to our kitties. Yeah. Okay, so we found the executioner. I think the executioner's chambers can be different depending on uh, how how your city is. So like it'll be more or less fucked up. I'm not sure though. Ooh, this is useful. Nice little bug out closet. Isn't that a potty? Yeah, but you can hide in there. To become the maid. Ooh. I wonder how Koro feels being able to like have breasts and menstruate. Probably not great. I mean, we don't know that he doesn't do that already, but Probably I'm assuming that it's enough. like. <laughs> Take five, honey. Here, this looks slightly more comfortable. It's got a sheet on it at least. Wait, you might want to shut that door. Yeah, I should really have this on at, like, all times. Uh. Is that a Fabergé egg I just picked up? Nah! Oh, shit. That kind of spooked me. What? Okay, this isn't working out. Shoot me. Shoot me. Do it. Yeah, I kind of wasn't sure about that one. Okay. Oh, we're back here. Nice. There we go. You know, your, um, your Carvo reminds me of Ocelot. Revolver Ocelot, you yeah. mean? Yeah. How so? He's very fancy and stuff, but he is kind of, like, clumsy in a way. He's a showman, you know? Yeah. Like, he makes a better showman than he does a fighter. Okay. Let's duck under here and drop a little save down. Corvo wanted to go to bard school. I mean, Corvo's apparently an appreciator of fine arts. Oh, well. Let's just run as fast as we can. Fuck. Well, I did save, at least, so we have that. It's time to play the music. It's time to light the lights. It's time to meet your maker on the Muppet Show tonight.
All right. So, I kind of wish I knew where I was taking this girl. Uh, let's let's go back in here. Hip. Hip. Sorry about that. And then maybe you could... Fresh save in here. You fresh save, and then maybe you could take over someone else's body. Because does it reset every body? What do you mean? Does your magic reset every time you take a body? Every time I use a spell, it leaves a little bit of blue on the bar. Mm -hmm. And after... Uh... Hey, you don't look so good. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. After a little bit of that, uh, if I wait a little, a little will come back. But normally it's not very much. Do you have potions for it? I do. Good. It's only as much to... Um... See, look. Perfectly natural. No one could ever suspect a thing about that. Do these guys wake up after a certain amount of time? Uh, no. I believe they have to be woken up by someone. He's really overworking his staff. Oh, yeah, absolutely. What the fuck is this? Is it art? Oh, it's it's a bull's head, but I'm looking at it from the wrong way. I thought I was looking at, like, a weird lipstick monster. <laughs> okay. Hip. Oh, I saw his shadow. Interesting. Drop another save. I'll just do this one. Put on the uh, uh, vision, night vision. Yeah. Okay, so he's there. Which means that I can just run, well, trot up on him. Nice, nice, nice. You can put him with the... Oh, well, right there, yeah. Everyone gets their own little slot. Everyone gets their own little closet, so we don't have any awkward waking ups, you know? All right, you might want to do another save. I'm going to check ahead a little bit here. Made way down there. Wait, that's not right. What? Look at my sword. Oh. That's a bug. Because it... Nope, oh, still happening. Oh, I hate that. No, yeah, that's a bug. Actually. Okay, so she turned around. So if I go here... Do a little save. Little savey save. Get down tonight. This is dangerous, but you know. See, so yeah, normally the uh, the refresh rate of your mana is only enough to. Man, these type of houses must get so cold in the winter. Yeah, well that that girl's like rubbing her hands together because she's chilly. Nipping out all over the place. Oh, we're back here. Okay, so then that means that we can go here. Yep. I noticed that there wasn't an option to peek through the keyhole because uh, that door was made of glass, which is kind of interesting. They just threw that other boar head in the closet. Uh, we've got too many boar heads up. Take them down. It's not boar season. Okay, so that's a little hidey tunnel that we can use as a rat. Yeah, we turn into a rat and, uh, or possess an extant rat, I, I mean. Might be able to. The wolfhound in there is a problem. It might be able to. An errant mind. Deep slart. And then. Can two okay. Yeah, good, 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 good. Body? No. Great. Sleep. Excellent. Oh, yeah. See, I'm almost ashamed now. Well, not ashamed. Oh, who saw me? What? Oh, fuck. Come on. Well, he doesn't even have it filled up, so he hasn't seen it all the way. Visit the torturer. Well, I've already been there, but... Kill the torturer. Oh, it checks it off. Nice, nice. Was there something else you needed to do over there? Like, look at his, is something he was looking at. Uh, the torture? On, yeah, on the pedestal there. Uh, he's got this book here, which is the Overseer Shield. Oh, okay, okay. Go ahead and pause it if you want, but... Alright, where to next? Uh, going up a floor. Did you do a little savey save? Actually, let me get up here, and then I'll save. Because this seems like a pretty good place. See, I've been relatively low kill as as the th as the game goes on, which 
I could have been doing the whole time, but I was just so out of practice. On kind of not having played this in a few years. Okay, cool. Peak. 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 Okay. Could you use your night vision? Yeah, make it a little safer. There's a rat in there. There's rats everywhere, wow. During a plague? Crazy. Hello, rat friend. Okay, so we've got a safe room in here. And a door to the roof. ourselves into a little situation here. What we've got here... Come on, come on, come on, get him. Yeah! Yeah! It's what you get for enjoying the art of the bourgeoisie. Yeah, look at that shit. What is it? I don't care. <laughs> the Empress and the Empty Set. Nice. Cash money. Oh! Uh... Hello, sir. Good night, sir. Smoking kills. So do I, but, you know. Decor plate. A book about Empress Jessamine Caldwin. Okay. Hip. Hmm. Another bust. This guy's such a fucking asshole. What do you mean? The... The, oh, uh, oh, the, the regent. I thought you meant like bust as in like you did something wrong, but you're like, no, a literal bust. Yeah. Uh, anyway, so I got distracted from what I was talking about earlier. But something that you can do, the the uh, the outsider actually mentioned this. But um, he asked if I would Start. fucking seriously. He asked if I would end it by blood or by truth. Something that you can do is get a note that says it's you can get a confession from the guy actually. What do you have to report about? Anyway, you can get a confession from the guy. Oh, well there he is. Yeah, I kind of expected that. You can get a confession from the guy and play it through the radio system so the whole town hears it. Wait, from who? From the regent. Got it, got it, got it. And if you like, we can do that. Ooh, that sounds kind of nice. Yeah, well, do you want to go for that? Okay, is that the option besides killing him? That is the alternate, uh, yeah, that's the alternate way. Okay, so I just needed to be patient. Ooh, I don't know. We haven't been killing a lot of his guys, just the torturer, and, like, that guy tortures people for fun. And, like, also it is his job, but, like, you know, he also just does it because he likes to. Most of these people aren't criminals. Yeah, let's go ahead and broadcast him. Okay. Because, yeah, I, I think that the... Um, hmm. Interesting. The playthrough where you... Uh, or where Corvo, rather, kills... You could be a rat. Only the targets? Yeah, but I don't have anywhere that I could really get to. And I don't want to be caught out in the open when I'm a rat. The playthrough where Corvo only kills uh, fools that are on the list makes more sense to me than where he only spares the ones that are on the list. Hmm. Huh? Oh, God. I thought he was on the staircase, to be honest. Yeah, that's the problem with dark vision. Sometimes that can just happen. Where you just get uh, confused about your position because you're seeing... The world in like four dimensions. You might be able to choke him out now. Oh yeah, I just want to get him back into this corner and then pop out of him and then. Oh he is. Oh, that's gross. All right. Oh, oh god. god. <laughs> well, I imagine uh, putting him face down in a pile of his own vomit is a pretty good. <laughs> god, that's extreme. Oh, it's like he ate pea soup <laughs> for lunch. Ugh. God. Oh, that's extreme. Hey, 
hated everything about that. Remember, there's a tall guy in there? Yeah, tall boy. Yep, there he is. So that's that looks to be the main problem for that upcoming area. Imagine you get inside of a tall boy and um, someone has to look up and it's like, man, I mean, you usually don't look good, but you look even worse. How is that possible? We even got you at the worst angle. You're swaying around up there. You're like 20 feet in the air. Are you good, fam? Didn't you practice in tall boy school? <laughs> yeah. You passed your entrance, entrance exams with straight A's. Okay. So I'm trying to see where I can get around here. Want to make a little savey save? Uh, I did. Okay. I popped one out there because I don't want to save in here with the tall boy because they're very they're very good at seeing shit. You see? Oh, we can go down here. Yeah, there's like five of them in there, or possibly just one. Well, that ain't good. Uh, anyway, yeah. So that's why I didn't save in here. <laughs> Well, I don't know. Well, I saved in this window because I figured that that would be safer. Here, sir. Oh, wait, maybe I can go down here. Him then. And hide behind this. Oh, that's a good idea, yeah. And then I might be able to... Sneak? Yeah, peek through there and then sneak under here. Yes, Lord Regent. Remember, your roof fortifications are completely secure, even if all else should fail. To the right? Huh? Fuck. So close. Okay, well, how about we just load and stop beating around the shit? Let's do here. Oh. Oh, right. I didn't make that save. The game did. Okay, that makes more sense. Why don't we just, uh solve uh solve this problem the 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 quick way huh for now i recommend you stay in the tower safely and try to remain calm okay i am calm can't do the head i lied you can only do it from the back from the front it doesn't work though you are correct the the issue isn't that they have a oh it's a helmet the issue isn't that they have a helmet, they have a mask on, and the mask is what protects them. I, oh, God. Ah, oh, well. You moited him real good. Yeah, that was a, that was an extreme noid. Okay. Trials of Aptitude. Go ahead and pause it if you want to read it. I'm uh, in full fucking kill mode. Oh, shit. Shit. Okay. Oh, he came from the door to the right? Looks like. Okay. Hmm. Wait, is that the Yeah, that's the Lord Regent. Let's take a look uh let's take a look around here. <laughs> There's me. Wait, what did you get a health drink? Whoa. Yeah, that's what happens if you assassinate them. You unlocked an achievement. I did it. Yay, I'm the winner. Okay, so that makes it... That's a problem then. Because killing him actually makes that a whole lot worse than I expected. Everything's because I expected to just kill him and be done with it, but if he's not in there, people get salty, which is an issue. So he's moving away, I'm moving forward, and he's moving away from me. So if we get in here before he turns around, I should be able to... Him. And you didn't kill him. Yeah. Wouldn't it be awkward if he woke up while I was carrying him like this? So I wonder if I can do something with this, because I don't want him I to fuck around with it. I haven't been held since I was a boy. <laughs> Remember that one guy who comes in? Yeah. I'm not sure from where... Oh, he comes from there. That's an issue. 
Okay, well, let's sneak around this way. Why don't we play a little... Yep. <laughs> yeah. Hey, the bunk room is the best place to nap, so you're in luck. And I got him before he even started puking, so... I'll call that a, uh, that's a, that's a win. I'll go ahead and save that, because that's yeah. a really solid one. Shabooms. Okay, so now we've got this to begin with. This will lead up to here. I don't know if I want to rewire that. Ah, I see. So yeah, that turns that off. Wherever you are. Wherever you may be. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Turn back. What's up? Uh, up. Move your camera up. Can you get him through there? Interesting. <sighs> I'm a genius. Uh-oh. Ow. Well. Well, hey, now we know. Now we know. Okay, well, I'll uh, I'll use dark vision to figure out where the tall boy is. Wait, wait, what a sec wait a second. Okay. What if we take a small five minute break? Um I am coming towards something. But then we will take a break. Okay. Dark vision. Blanc. Possess him. Yes. Now I'm gonna go slap my nuts against something. I'm the Lord Regent. Who could ever stop me? The reason why is I need his keys. Okay. I think. Okay, never mind. Huh. I guess I was wrong. Well, that makes it kind of a problem. Huh. Oh. <laughs> that would be the uh, the key then, huh? Someone has strangled the Lord Regent. Weird. It's not even his Thursday choke and stroke. Ugh. You know, I feel very safe here, so why don't we just make a little save game? And then, yeah, we'll take a five-minute break. I have been Alfred. And I have been Sarah. Uh, we'll see you guys in the next episode of Dishonored because we have been recording for 50 minutes. So we'll see you guys next time. See you next time. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Get rat that makes all of the rules. Let's see what kind of troll we can get ourselves into.